Hi Pisces, Cancer and Scorpio, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out the person on your mind right now. How do they feel about you currently? To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. Today is the 22nd of June, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia, <coughs> excuse me, is 8.07 a.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. If you were to finally get it to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same sign. Spirits and angels, please show me for Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. The person on their mind right now, how do they feel about them? So think about this person, okay? The person on your mind. Person in your mind could be anybody, could be a friend, somebody you could be currently connected to, or in the past, family member, somebody who, somebody you work with, boss, co-worker, family member, have I already said family member? <laughs> anybody, okay? Just think of that person right now. Page of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay. The person in your mind right now with the Seven of Pentacles here feels like, what the heck happened? <laughs> what the heck happened? <laughs> My life is has changed. The death here. My life has changed because of a decision that has been made. Because the death can indicate transformation, right? And then the High Priestess here, it's like, them feeling as though, wow, this is huge, but also feel like they need to keep this to himself or herself, okay? Because the high, high priestess holds all the information, holds secrets. They could be secretly feel like, whoa, what just happened here with the seven of pentacles? Because these pentacles are hidden as well, hidden in the bush. So they could be feeling like just looking at these pentacles except for one here that is out so they could be feeling as though i need to really keep this to myself like what has just happened my life has just changed everything has just changed dramatically because again death indicates a huge transformation it can indicate a separation but it could also indicate just like a you know when there's an ending there's a new beginning so the lover is here they secretly loves you cares about you and then the ten of pentacles four cups in one verse a lot of details in this reading so I'll just take what resonates with you okay some of you if this is a family member ten of pentacles this is very very specific this part just bear in mind not for all of you okay for those of you, if you have somebody like a mom or a dad, a parent, an uncle, aunt, whoever, a family member older than you are who has passed on and then decided to leave you a lot of money, more, leave, like uh, leave you more money than the other, there's something about, I cannot believe I got this inheritance, Ten of Pentacles, because Ten of Pentacles can get inheritance. Either you cannot believe that they have left you a lot or that they have left you too little, okay? It could go vice versa. And it just shows, it showed favoritism, okay? <laughs> I told you, this part of the storyline is not for all of you, very specific. But generally, the person in your mind right now could be observing, waiting to see Ten of Pentacles, Four of Cups in one verse, if there could be a future for the both of you could also be analyzing whether you know will this be a missed opportunity or has this become a missed opportunity they're definitely keeping something to themselves so that they feel like you are acting very secretive okay this person could be feeling like you're acting very secretive there's something they could be trying to look for some pentacles in regards of you your connection with someone in particular and the empress here is in reverse so they've and the six of cups here is also in reverse so they feel like maybe 
Maybe you've given up. Yeah, maybe you've give, given up the Empress in reverse. This person may be feeling like, okay, you're less nurturing, you're less kind to them now, or you're, you're not really paying them a lot of attention. They could be wondering, okay, have you, have you made a new friend? Or have you, are you talking to someone else? Um, do you have a new partner, if this is a business partner? A new partnership, okay, a new partnership. They feel like you're keeping a secret, like you're keeping quiet. Maybe you are partnering up with someone else. Like there's a, you know, the lover's foul soul to your lovers. It's almost like them feeling that you have someone else, you have a different, um, either different friend or different set of friends, different community, different group, different something here, okay? Because the death here again, it's almost like them feeling you have you have some like you are involved with something else there's something they're suspicious about it feels a little bit suspicious because again the self is like looking at you know looking at this bush here this pentacles trying to look for something favel sword here is in one first they feel like maybe this is why you haven't been you know, you haven't shown interest, or if you've been keeping very quiet, you haven't said anything, anything, have you, like, taken up another offer, have you, you know, embarked on something else, that, that they perhaps are not a part of it, okay, are you ever gonna call them, or return their messages, are you, are you ever gonna, return something about them feeling like as though you you're not returning this time you're not returning the death here it's like this time it's done deal you're never returning you're never gonna talk to them you're never gonna because you have either your own life now you have your own person now own things going on your focus is elsewhere your interest is elsewhere okay hope that makes sense to you As an extra, I'll take it. Page of Pentacles, Judgment, and then we've got the Queen of Swords here. Yeah, they feel like it, maybe you've decided you've cut this person off or that finally you are making a decision because the love is indicates a choice, a decision to do something else, but it's without this person, okay? The Judgment here, they could be feeling as though they need to talk to you, they need to hash things out with you, page of pentacles, yeah, they feel like they want to talk to you, but you could be giving them a silent treatment, or just acting very cold towards them, and the emperor hits them up first, so the person in your mind could be an Aries, could be a Libra, Gemini, Chris, Sagittarius, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, Leo, doesn't matter, can be any sign, Gemini here as well, okay, they feel like this is completely out of their control, right? The emperor in my verse, like the nada wants in my verse, as though they they cannot. It's like the only way for them to get you to talk to them, to get you to consider them, or get you to reciprocate, if they were to offer you something really good here. Something valuable okay or an apology can be anything but an offer here so they feel like they have to offer you something or say something to you that is nice or kind in order for you to reciprocate um for some of them this person may have wait may have been waiting for an answer from you so some pentacles is like waiting They've been waiting, 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 but maybe they've waited for too long that maybe they could be feeling like if I wait for too long, that that means I get the answer. Even if you don't tell them, then it's like, okay, I get it. Maybe you, water signs, you are going to just choose something else. That could be a sign that you have given up on this connection. 
They feel like maybe you've been judging them, and then you've made your decision here with the lovers, with the judgment and the lovers. Yeah. They've been analyzing what they have said, the past, all of that. Hmm. All right, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel. It's called Chelsea Vlogs. It's my travel channel. Um, and if you'd like to be notified every time when I post your videos and every time when I go live, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. All right, take care. Hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Bye.